Hello and welcome to the history of movie theaters and drive-ins for the Wyoming Valley including Lackawanna and Luzerne counties for 1960 to 1979. Nineteen sixty. The old Riviera in Scranton is reopened as the center on October sixth by Comerford Theaters. The Hiller Theater in Dallas closes. Nineteen sixty one. The Ideal Drive-In in, in Carbondale closes. 1962 Cinerama arrives at the Strand Theatre in Scranton with The Wonderful World of the Brothers Grimm on December 21. 4 Theaters closed these theaters. 1963 These theaters closed in 1963. 1964 February The Diamond Theater in Hazleton reopens. The Gateway Cinema in Edwardsville is opened by Comerford Theatres on December 26. The Feely Theatre in Hazleton reopens on December 26. The Granada Theatre in Oliphant closes. 1966 Look out! Here comes the biggest bond of all! Thunderball! Nineteen sixty seven. These theaters closed in nineteen sixty seven. 1968 These theaters closed in 1968 1969 Cinecom buys out Comerford Theaters on September 3rd The Churchill Cinema in Hazleton opens on April 5th. The Old Comerford Theatre is reopened on December 25th as the Cinema North in Clark Summit. The Hersker Theatre in Hazleton reopens on December 25th. These theatres closed in 1969. 1970 The Cinema 2 in Peckville opens. These theaters starts to show adult movies. The Feely Theater in Hazleton hosts the world premiere of Molly Maguire's. The Grand Theatre in Edwardsville closes. 1971 The Cinema 309 in Wilkes Bar is opened by Hallmark and Cinecom Theatres on February 10th. The Bernie Cinema in Musick is opened by Cinecom Theatres on March 5th. The Riverview Drive-In in, in Pittston closes. 1972 
The Wyoming Mall Cinema 1 and 2 in Wilkes-Barre is opened by General Cinemas on June 21st becoming a very popular cinema. The Bar Loge in Wilkes Bar is opened on August 18th by Cinecom in the balcony of the Old Comerford Theater. The Bar West in Wilkes Bar opens on December 23rd downstairs in the Old Comerford Theater. 1973 The Bar East in Wilkes Bar opens on February 2nd downstairs in the Old Comerford Theater. Cinecom Theaters goes bankrupt closing most Cinecom Theaters in the area on July 28th. On September 27th the District Attorney and the police halts the showing of Deep Throat at the Cinema 309 in Wilkes Bar. The Viewmont Cinemas in Scranton opens with three screens by General Cinemas on October 31st. It becomes very popular as the Cinecom theaters were closed at this time. 1974 The Scrantonian reports on April 7th that the old Cinecom theaters were reopened by Sports Service. The Grand Theatre in Hazleton starts to show adult movies. 1975 The Times Tribune in Scranton restricts ads for R-rated movies to two column inches. These theaters closed in 1975. 1977 The Wyoming Mall Cinemas in Wilkes Bar expands to five screens on February 11th. The Churchill Cinema in Hazleton reopens as a twin on July 1st with a wall down the middle splitting the screens. time ago, in a galaxy far, far away, Here they come. Star Wars, Coming in too fast. an adventure unlike anything on your planet, it's an epic of heroes, and villains, and aliens from a thousand worlds, Star Wars, rated PG. The Gateway Cinema in Edwardsville reopens as a twin cinema on October 5th. The Bernie Cinema in Musick becomes an adult cinema. These cinemas closed in 1977. 1978 The Ritz Courtyard in Scranton opens on November 15th. These theaters closed in 1978. 1979 The General Cinemas Viewmont Cinemas in Scranton add screens 4 and 5 on June 29th. These cinemas closed in 1979. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe.